Welcome to the video, my name is Jean, spelled like Jean, it's French, and today I'm going to do something a little different than I normally do. A couple days ago, Nick Bear, YouTuber, owns a company, very cool, very ripped, does crazy things, posted a CrossFit workout, and naturally I'm like, ooh, CrossFit workout? This is my jam, this is my area. My goal is to beat him in this workout, which He's like he's crazy. Like he does crazy things all the time. Marathons and rock marches and CrossFit and deadlifts like stupid amounts of weight. But this is a very body weight movement and I weigh less than him. And this is a CrossFit specific workout and I do CrossFit more than him. So I thought here's a chance for me to beat this crazy fitness person. Why not go for it? <laughs> So what is the hundreds workout? I'm so glad you asked, because I'm gonna explain that to you right now. The hundreds workout is five rounds for time of 20 reps of each, equaling 100 of each of these movements. It's gonna be 20 calories in the assault bike, 20 wall balls with a 20 pound wall ball, 20 box jumps on a 24 inch box, 20 burpees, and 20 kettlebell swings with a 53 pound kettlebell. As I said before, I really do believe that I have a shot to beat him at his time, but I think there's a couple things working against him and a couple things working against me. Against him, I don't think he thought that some CrossFitter little guy was gonna be like, I'm gonna beat him. So he probably didn't have that like, I need to crush this person mentality that I'm trying to get up here. And then the second thing is he's got like this, he's weighs more than me, is stronger than me, has more muscle mass than me, but he has this like, I will die before I stop mentality that I'm kind of not there. Like I throttle my workouts when they get too hard. So those are the two things where I'm kind of like, okay, to be fair, you know, and, and this might not work out as well. But on paper or on a whiteboard, this workout seems to favor me. Find out. So the time that he got on his video was 29.22. That's about a little bit less than a six minute per round pace, something I really think I can hold. That's gonna be my mental, like, check mark is gonna be, am I hitting that six minute pace? You'll, you'll be able to tell, I don't know, first round in if you're meeting that or not. All right, let's do it. I'm officially off the pace to beat him. Crap.
part. <laughs> that workout took me a lot longer than I thought it was gonna. All right, it's been a couple hours since I've done that workout. I've taken a shower, I've changed, and I just wanted to kind of finish this video off by saying what I thought about it. Um, here's what I thought about it. Yeah, it sucked, it was terrible. It was literally such a hard workout that I totally underestimated, but I'm so glad I did it. I ended up getting 40 minutes and 50 seconds, as you guys saw earlier. Nick Bear got 29.22, so needless to say, he crushed me in that workout. But it just goes to show how incredible of an athlete that he is and that I need to grow and develop in specific things such as not technical, just moving movements. Once I realized I was off pace to beat him, it became a mental workout more than anything because why was I doing this? I was doing this to try to beat him and, and when that wasn't gonna happen, I wasn't just gonna quit the workout. I needed to make sure that I finished for myself and that ended up being really difficult and really hard but I'm glad I did it I'm glad I pushed through it I honestly around round three and round four was just questioning everything about life about uh, circumstances about situations what had I done in my life that brought me to this situation round five was the best one to get done because I just tried to push through it. Sometimes it's good to do stupid stuff like that. Just to prove to yourself that you can do it, you know? So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's gonna be where I end it today. If you have any questions about it, if you have anything, any comments, just leave it down below. We'll talk in the comments, it'll be a good time. And Nick, that was a terrible workout. I can't wait for you to, to make another one.